Finding the best brightness and contrast settings for monitor use isn't as complicated as you might think, but it makes a massive difference in how everything looks on your screen. You can start by right-clicking on your desktop to open your graphics control panel, or just press the menu button on your monitor if you want to work directly with the built-in settings. Brightness is where you'll want to begin since it affects literally everything you see. Set it to 50% first, then open a white document or web page. If that white looks gray or dim to you, push it up to 60 or 70%. If your eyes are hurting or feeling like it's too bright, then drop it down to 40%. Most people end up somewhere between 30 and 50% for indoor use, but your room lighting matters a lot here. Now contrast is what gives you the full range from dark to light, and 75% makes a good starting point. Open any photo that has both really dark and bright areas in it. Look at those shadows and highlights while you adjust. When the dark areas look completely black with no detail, you need to lower the contrast. Same thing if the bright areas look blown out white. You'll probably end up around 70 to 80%. Here's something that actually works for testing your settings instead of just guessing. Search for Logom LCD test and use their black level test page. You should barely see the difference between squares 1 and 2. Can't see any squares? Too low. See all of them clearly? Too high. Do the same thing with their white saturation test. You should see the difference between squares 253 and 254, but if they look identical, your contrast is cranked too high. Save whatever looks good to you, because every monitor is different, and every room has different lighting. What looks comfortable to your eyes is what matters, since you're the one staring at it all day.